for those of you who don't recognize my face or, or my voice, my name is Damien with my blueprint. And I have the privilege of introducing Larissa. I mean, if, if you have worked with me before, you know that I'm not a fan of PowerPoints. I'm not a fan of big, long slides and introductions. So I'm not going to take too much time. I'm going to let Larissa take over because she's kind of the star of, of today's show. Goes without saying that our, our world has changed. The workplace experiences that our students have had access to in the past aren't always going to be there this year. So we, we need to adapt. And luckily, we have friends and we have partners at Edge Factor who have amazing content and amazing resources that they're willing to share with you lovely folks to help kind of bridge that divide and create these virtual workplace experiences just in time for Take Our Kids to Work Day. So Lewis is gonna talk a little bit about that, a little bit about who they are at Edge Factor and, and all the wonderful opportunities that provides you as educators. So with that, you know, Larissa, I'm gonna stop sharing and, and take it away. Awesome. Well, thanks so much, Damien. It's great to connect with all of you. I am the Vice President of Edge Factor, and we were founded in 2010, and I started in very early 2012. So Jeremy is the founder of Edge Factor, and he and I have tag teamed for the last eight and a half, nine years now, focusing really on how can we help uh, equip educators with e-learning tools to engage students both in classrooms and at home. And today I'm excited to showcase some of the free tools that we have available for educators. We're gonna focus on the sidebar. If you're on edgefactor.com, you can click on the K-12 educator on the bench, which is what I just did. As you can see, I'm actually not even logged in. So you don't have to create an Edge Factor membership to, create, to access these tools. You can click on the K-12 educator and on the sidebar, you see it says experiences and free toolkits. I'm going to click on free toolkits. So there's a number of tools that I'm excited to share with you. The first one is all about Take Our Kids to Work Day, which is, of course, being hosted on November 4th, 2020. But we are making these tools available from now until December 1st. So you can go to this page and I'm going to actually copy this right into our live chat. So here on the Take Our Kids to Work Day page, we are making eight virtual workplace experience videos completely for free, as well as eight accompanying lesson plans. So we wanted to provide uh, educators with tools to host a virtual Take Our Kids to Work Day experience. And of course, to do that, we wanted to showcase different industries and different opportunities. And so as you scroll through, you can uh, click on any one of these thumbnails and it will open up the media player and the video plays automatically. So during COVID, it's been such an interesting time. Of course, everybody's lives have been impacted uh, by this pandemic. For Edge Factor, as a media company, we create thousands of videos and quizzes and lesson plans for uh, educators to use to showcase careers, show how STEAM comes alive in the real world, help students understand the opportunities that are available for them. So when COVID hit in, in the height in February and March, Edge Factor sat down as a team and, and we were talking about how can we really innovate during this time? How can we tool up and continue to roll cameras? And the way that we've been able to mobilize during this time is really through virtual workplace experiences. These are all 10 to 15 minute videos that are essentially virtual field trips, showing students what it's like to work in diverse industries. In the last six months, we have filmed 110 virtual workplace experiences, all focusing on things like agriculture and construction, manufacturing, hairdressing, you name it. There's been so many different types of companies that we've filmed with. Here's an example of one that's available for free in the Take Our Kids to Work Day. Every virtual workplace experience in the first 10 or 15 seconds has a menu item that shows all of the different chapters that are included in this experience. These are available from now until December 1st for free. Here in the agriculture milking technology, we filmed at a cattle farm. And here you've got a young woman in skilled trades talking about how to make the cows feel comfortable to be able to produce milk, milking robots and technology, some really high end things that they're using, RFID collars, transporting milk from the farm. 
And so as you scroll through, I'm just gonna jump ahead for a second. Here you've got a young woman talking directly to camera, directly to students, providing key insights on how this technology works and basically what a day in the life of a cattle farm looks like. So really interesting. I'm gonna go back for a minute. And here you've got culinary food services. So I'm gonna click on that one for a moment. And again, I'm gonna jump ahead uh, to be able to see the menu. So this one is of course on a culinary sous chef at a hospitality and tourism lodge. She's talking about having the mind of a sous chef using their high-end ovens, steam kettles, talking the, about the difference between the front and the back of the kitchen. So all of these different videos, there are eight total that are available for free. Here you've got one for construction on commercial HVAC. Here's one on mining, hydroelectric power. As you scroll down, the bucket shop, here is a, a virtual workplace experience on metal forming and creation, talking about welding and plasma cutting, materials and safety things to keep in mind. Here's one on manufacturing hairdressing, and here's one that uh, I want to click on for a quick minute. One of the key focuses that we had this last summer, we partnered with over a dozen school boards in Ontario to create content that specifically showcased Indigenous community members in the skilled trades. And so here, this one is a little bit unique. We filmed this on Manitoulin Island with a company called Henley Boats that is Indigenous owned and operated. Here you've got an Indigenous community member as the host of this video, the spokesperson showcasing information on different types of boat styles, boat structures, the process of welding, and how they assemble uh, their different boats and, and the, the repairs that they do. So in partnership with My Blueprint, we want to make sure that there are lesson plans that provide more information that would be able to evaluate some of the students' learning, as well as give you the tools for students to download badges and add them to their student portfolios right in My Blueprint. So here, to download the free lesson plans that accompany each of these videos, you can fill out a couple of key pieces of information, you click download my lesson plan. You can download by clicking on any one of these images. If you want all of them, go for it. You can click on all of them to download. I'm gonna download, for instance, the hairdressing one. So here it opens it up as a PDF and in the top right hand corner, I can save it. So here you've got the learning outcomes, objectives and technical skills, the learning goals, which focus on who am I, what do I know? Where am I going? How do I get there? And of course, how do I succeed? And as you scroll down, you can see that there's an opening activity, step-by-step -step instructions on how to log into my blueprint. And here's the guided practice, as well as the after the lesson tools that students can answer questions, as well as, of course, download this edge factor badge of completion, and they can add it to their student portfolio. And again, all of the key pieces of information are there for how to do that. Here are some of the other partners. There is the link for Take Our Kids to Work Day. So again, recap, you've got eight virtual workplace experiences available on this page and you've got eight free lesson plans. If you are an Edge Factor member, you can also click view now and you can view the 100 plus virtual workplace experiences that we've created. You can choose whichever ones you want to be able to share on Take Your Kids to Work Day. We also wanted to make sure that we have a dose of inspiration. So Edge Factor, in, at our heart, we are still storytellers. There is a real power that comes when you can showcase a real life story of someone who's accomplished something, who's used their head, hands, and technology to build or make something. And so as part of this free offering, we are providing five free films that you can also use in honor of Take Your Kids to Work Day. Or again, if you wanna play that later on throughout the month, all of these are available for free until December 1st. Here you've got Metal and Flesh, the story of a man who gets into a uh, horrific snowmobiling accident. He loses his leg. He starts a company building prosthetic limbs for other challenged athletes. He actually goes on to win the X Games 10 times and uh, wins uh, Team USA for um, the Paralympics. Masters of Resonance, if there's any Rush fans in the crowd, this is a film that we worked with Neil Peart on, the drummer from Rush. We co-wrote the voiceover. We tell the story from the forest to the stage of the making of his R40 drum kit. Then there's a couple of other stories that you are welcome to check out. 
stories of students using 3D printing to build an exoskeleton hand for stroke victims. Uh, you've got the Chilean Mine Rescue, an amazing story of engineering and how they rescued those 33 miners trapped 2,300 feet underground. Yes, to answer Eric's question, there are lesson plans for every single one of those 100 virtual workplace experiences. All right, so we've gone through the Take Our Kids to Work Day. Fantastic. Here is the free campaigns page. You can click on this. You can feel free to open up a new tab. And I'm going to go through something that is uh, available for the month of October. This is Manufacturing Month. If you're not familiar with MFG Day, this is a national movement where typically in, in non-COVID years, manufacturers open up their doors to host tours and welcome the community to be able to discover the opportunities uh, for careers that they have and that they offer. So in the last five years, Edge Factor has helped host uh, thousands of events across North America for Manufacturing Day. And here we've got a toolkit that we provide that is available for free for the month of October for people to go in and really showcase how STEAM comes alive in the world of manufacturing. So one of the key components of a free experience is five days of STEAM. Now I want to take a minute and say it's really important for us all to wrap our heads around what's included in a toolkit because we use this formula throughout 2021 experiences that will be available for free as well. So the first thing included in a free toolkit is five days of STEAM programming. I'm going to click on day one science. Here you have an inspirational video talking about how automation is impacting the future of the manufacturing industry. This is part of another series that we created called Careers of the Future, talking about how emerging and disruptive technologies are really shaping the future. Here you've got some exploration tools, four free career profile videos that showcase how science is used in manufacturing careers. Here is preparation tools, You've got eight science videos with interactive quizzes that showcase how science topics come alive in the world of manufacturing. And here is a soft skills video specifically on communication. Again, if you click on any one of these, it will open up the media player. There's also four additional cinematic films that are available at the bottom. And that is just one of the days, one of the five days. So there's a lot of content here that is available. If I click on day two, technology, here you can see another free virtual workplace experience on robotics filmed in Stony Creek, Hamilton, Ontario. You've got three career profile videos on robotics and design. There are eight technology videos and then a soft skills video and again, four free films. So you can very simply copy and paste this link across your social media, you can share it with all of the educators, parents, students across your network, and everybody can go to this page. They do not have to log in. Again, this entire time I have not been logged in and I'm able to access all of these tools. These tools are available specifically for manufacturing month. The Rock MFG Day kit is only available until October 31st. So you can go through and I encourage you to share this across your network. The second tool that is available in a toolkit is a keynote presentation. Jeremy, here's a photo of our founder. He spent 12 years as a five axis machinist. He's super passionate about manufacturing. And so in this 15 minute, approximately 17 minute keynote presentation, he takes moments from some of our key inspirational stories and he talks about lessons learned. Especially in this video, he actually featured a couple of different companies that we filmed with in the past that have retooled during this time to be able to actually create items for like hand sanitizer. This is a, a company that we featured in, in last uh, May, I believe. We filmed some career profiles with them and here they've tooled up to be able to create hand sanitizer. So he's just talking about the power of manufacturing and really life lessons that are learned. If you think about that Mike story, he loses his leg, he builds his own prosthetic. One of the key lessons that, that students can extract from that story is that you can be faced with one of the biggest challenges of your life. And what do you do when you're faced with that challenge? Do you, do you sink or do you rise? The third key component, how to guide. So this steps into a connection really between businesses 
education and workforce development leaders. So what we've done is we're making these tools available for everyone. So here for business leaders, for instance, why should your company host a manufacturing day event? What is manufacturing day and how can uh, I as a company benefit from engaging with my local schools and engaging with my local parents and students? How to host an awesome virtual event, again, pre-written for businesses, high schools and post-secondary and workforce leaders. So if I click on how to host an awesome virtual event, here is an in-depth checklist that gives you all of the information you need on the Rock MFG Day Kit, even on understanding how to uh, choose a virtual platform, how to host an engaging presentation or webinar for your students, as well as finally, promotional tools. If you click on this, you can click here to download and we have created a Word document that you can copy and paste download free images so that you guys can very easily share these tools across your network. So if I wanted to share the day three engineering, I could simply copy and paste this and download an image right onto Twitter or Facebook or Instagram. So we're making it as easy as humanly possible. So as you scroll through, there's a couple of additional tools here as well. So to recap, five days of STEAM programming, a keynote presentation, and how-to guides. I'm gonna go back to the free toolkits. So when you think about the manufacturing day kit, everything we just went through, you can begin to understand the different toolkits that we're making available in 2021 and really understand the tools that will be available in each of these toolkits. Okay. And guys, keep asking great questions. If, if you have bigger ones that you want Larissa to tackle at the end, you know, throw them in the Q&A. Keep, keep the questions coming. These are great. So on this free campaigns page, again, here you have the Take Our Kids to Work Day. This is available for free during the month of November 2020. To view it, simply click View Now. For the current Rock Manufacturing Kit, you can click here. It says Enter This Month's Free Experience. Then as we scroll down, I want to take a couple minutes and, and begin to plan ahead with you. So in January and February, we are celebrating uh, technical education programs, things like OEAP, SHS, ADST, tech ed programs. And this will include five days of STEAM programming, a keynote presentation, and those how-to guides. So the Rock MFG Day Kit is really a perfect example of what you can expect for all of these different toolkits. In March and April, March is of course International uh, Women's Day. And so we are celebrating women in skilled trades. We're gonna be bringing in many of the stories and videos that we've told of, of different women in very various skilled trades industries. May and June, <clears throat> June is Indigenous Awareness Month. So we've got Indigenous community members, lots of content with Indigenous hosts of virtual workplace experiences, careers, and more. In July and August, you can expect a turnkey toolkit uh, for summer camps that bring STEAM to life. Next year, we've got another manufacturing day kit, and then we'll be focusing on apprenticeships in November and, and December of 2021. So as you scroll through on this page, you can see it says pre-register now on each of these pages. I'm going to click on future skills pre-register now. And here it answers the question, when is it coming? When will it be available? And what's included in this kit? Here are even some quotes of the different types of people like parents, educators, companies, and workforce leaders, how they will be able to access these tools. You've got promotional tools, keynote presentation, all of these different five days of STEAM programming tools, the how-to guides, and bonus materials. So you can scroll down and you can fill out this uh, form to let us know if you're an educator or a different type of community leader, what organization are you from? And as you click register, you'll create, you'll, you'll be able to have access as soon as it goes live, we'll keep you in contact throughout the year. So if you wanted to, you could literally pre-register for all of these today and you will get email notifications throughout the year that keep you in the loop. If you are on the call and you already have an Edge Factor membership, these, as soon as they're created, will be available for you throughout the year. So this is the key page that we wanted to go through. I'd like to send out a poll now and just get your feedback on which experience you are most interested in. This does not include Take Our Kids to Work Day. This is really focusing on the 2021 experiences.
And we're just gonna launch the poll now. So which experience are you most interested in? Future skills, women in skilled trades, indigenous tradespeople, summer camps, rock MFG day, or apprenticeships. And you can actually just click on this exact poll. You can choose which one you are most interested in. You can absolutely register as a school. You simply click on pre-register now. You'll be taken to a page with all of the information on the toolkit. And then you can scroll all the way to the, down to the bottom, fill out your info, click register, and you will be signed up to receive email notifications. You got it. So the free toolkits that are available, free is the operative word. There is absolutely no cost to any of these tools. If you are interested in unlocking the full Edge Factor platform, as you scroll through the different sidebars, you can see the content that we have available and you can learn more about the tools that we provide. So here we've received results. Okay, so 35% say they are most interested in future skills. Awesome. That will be live uh, very soon. In, in mid-January, you'll receive notifications of those tools. 21% women in skilled trades, 10% indigenous, 0% in summer camps. That is very interesting. Maybe I'll have to rename it so that people become more interested in it. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, Rock MFG day, 4%, and then apprenticeships at 31. Very interesting. Thank you guys so much for your feedback. That's, that's very helpful. Will my blueprint send out registration invites for these upcoming events? We, we, we can guys, we're always happy to promote uh, edge factor. We're big fans of them, but you know, I would take Larissa up on, on what she su suggested by heading uh, to that URL with the free campaigns and, and just pre-registering them for, for now. Right. Cause then you're already registered. They're going to let you know about them and you don't have to do right. anything in, until they tell you about them. That's right. And we'll be hosting webinars as well to be able to train you guys on what's included in the kit. Just like in the rock MFG day kit though, we will also have, uh, tutorial videos that are available. So just like if I scroll down here, you can watch a tutorial video. It's about eight minutes long and it provides a full overview of each of the kits. So we will have an individual tutorial for every single one of these that help. I I'm getting some questions here for what is the cost of edge factor? What's included? I'm going to go through this really quickly. So everything that we've talked about to date is free. You can access all of these tools again on this URL. If you are curious, if you're looking for ways to engage students, you wanna go above and beyond these free toolkits. An Edge Factor membership is, is typically purchased at a board level or at a school district level. The more school memberships that you purchase, the cheaper it is. So if I open up our tools and pricing, I can provide you guys with this link as well. For elementary schools and for middle schools, as well as for any school with less than 500 students, the cost is $1,000 per school. So that would give you unlimited access to everything. So we've got thousands and thousands of videos. In fact, if I think about our virtual workplace experiences alone, uh, you can scroll through and you can see some of these tools. You can actually click on search content series virtual workplace experiences, and you can see all of the different videos that we've created. You can scroll through and you can begin to understand all of the different programs at your school that would be able to tap into these unique tools. If you click on stories, you can see all of our inspirational films and see what we have uh, available. Here's the careers of the future full series, all of our different uh, cinematic stories. Underneath careers, we have hundreds of career profile videos and industry overview videos. I think about healthcare and manufacturing and transportation and IT. All of these different industries Edge Factor has created deep libraries of content for. Then you step into STEAM content, bite-sized videos that focus on science, technology, engineering, art, math, helping students to understand what tools come alive in the world of work. How does STEAM come alive on the job? Really helping to answer that question, when in real life am I ever gonna use what you're teaching me? So that is our, our approach to STEAM. And then of course, soft skills. We've got a financial literacy series that we are releasing in a couple of weeks. We're really excited about that. We also have virtual reality that's going live in 2021. Here on the soft skills page, you can see we've got all sorts of topics that we address like problem solving and leadership and uh, teamwork and the list goes on and on.
as you can see here, it is now pinging me to create a free membership. And you can tell what is available via a paid membership because there is a lock button on the sidebar. So if you're interested in having an Edge Factor membership, of course, you can connect with us anytime. Uh, again, our tools and pricing page will help you to understand what the costs associated are. For a high school, the annual membership fee is $2,500. When you purchase five or more, there are significant discounts that are available. Instantly, you save 20% when five plus schools purchase and the discounts continue from there. I'm personally a little bit biased, obviously, because I've been working with my blueprint for so long now and you know we share a similar vision to edge factor of you know wanting to make sure students have all the resources they need to make more informed decisions about their futures about life after high school and you know we all know that our students they're living on their screens right and and they expect high quality content you're not going to find better high quality up-to-date engaging content that's cinematic type type of content for your students so Obviously, I'm biased and I know we all wish we just had a magic wand and, and had all the money in the world. But for those prices to engage your students in making these decisions as a Canadian company, you know, this is awesome what you guys are doing, Marissa. Thank you. Thank you. To answer Keith's question for grade 11 and 12 co-op. So you're touching on something right now. I'm located in Ontario. When I click on search content under created for you, here are all of the different curriculum aligned pages that we've created for educators to be able to quickly and easily find what they're looking for. So for Keith, he's asking about grade 11 and 12 co-op. It all depends on where you're located. Uh, we've got all sorts of, if I, if I was to sign in right, right now, I can search for the CLE and CLC curriculums, for instance, uh, that we've done for BC. We've also done the ADST curriculum alignment. So you'll be able to very quickly uh, find what you're looking for and assign this content to students to be able to basically blast it out and they would receive notifications that they have a new activity and video to watch. To answer Nicole's question, uh, that $2,500 uh, or all of our prices, it's regardless of where you're located, the price is the same. The only difference is that there's HST for Canada. Yes, so I see a question here. If we purchase a membership for one high school, would we have unlimited access to Edge Factor? Could all classes access the videos? Absolutely. It is a brick and mortar license. So whenever we have an Edge Factor membership that is sold to a school, every single educator and every single student can have their own login. So if you're based in Ontario, we've got the D2L Brightspace integration that makes it really easy for everybody to be able to log in. All of your classes from D2L would already be in the system. And then there's lots of other learning management systems as well. I think of, I was just gonna say Google SSO, so Google SSO is coming early 2021. So we're really excited to launch that. We're going to be updating our homepage even with some of that information so that schools, educators, students can create a membership within seconds. We also do things like bulk uploads, anonymous students. There's all sorts of ways that people can easily log in. My school is a virtual school. My students are all over the place. No, that is not a problem at all. Um, we would just work with your IT team to make sure that we can access the student login, um, their usernames, and then we would set a password for them so that you can go into your users and groups and actually be able to create classes so that you can bulk send students home with content. Microsoft Teams is really a, a video conferencing system. So what we've done in our toolkits, actually, if I think about the Rock MFG Day kit, we've helped people to understand how they can use systems like Microsoft Teams, like Zoom, like Google Meets, to be able to host engaging sessions with students, especially for virtual co-ops. We've got a lot of different lesson plans that we're creating that would help educators to actually host a virtual co-op session. Interestingly, Damien, it seems like people feel like the toolkits are very straightforward, which is great. There's not a lot of questions on that, which I'm always like, yeah. that's awesome. It means that, that we created it in such a way that is clear. <laughs> you did. And this is a really smart group. So yes, uh, of course. it's a combination of the two. So if I were to kind of summarize everything we talked about, Taylor, and it's amazing that you guys are asking questions about, about pricing that just kind of shows the value of what Edge Factor has to offer. I mean, the intention was to, to talk about all the free resources, right? So for the rest of October, we have the Rock MFG days, so your manufacturing resources, the five days of steam, 
also starting now, but then through the end of uh, November, you have your virtual workplace experiences. Those come with a complimentary lesson plan to have students reflecting on what they're watching and learning uh, within my blueprint. And then, you know, after you have a good taste of the freebies, you'll see for yourself the quality that is Edge Factor. And, and if it makes sense for your school, this is again why we're collaborating on something like this with Edge Factor, because we believe these resources will help your students make more informed decisions. So hopefully you guys can uh, figure out a way to make these available to all of your students as well, even if it's just the free resources that are available right now. That's right. So I'm just doing three quick uh, next steps for people. So number one is pre-register for the Rock MFG Day Kit. The link is right there. Number two, register. You don't even have to register actually. The Take Our Kids to Work Day, you can simply download the lesson plans by clicking here. And then number three would be you can pre-register for all of the future uh, skills as well as 2021 experiences. So all of the links are right there. Yeah. Awesome. And we're going to include all the links and everything in the recap email that we send out along with uh, this recording. Larissa, what's the best way for people who are interested and have more questions for you? Is it, uh, I don't want to just throw your email out there. What's the best way for you people can to totally ask this throw question? my email out there. I'm used mm -hmm. to it. All good. There I can, go, uh, I can put that right there. You can also email info at edgefactor.com. That will lead you to our support team. They can answer your questions as well. Wow. Okay, Larissa, you did not disappoint. Tons of free resources to keep you and your students busy for the next little while and throughout the course of the next calendar year, which is amazing. Larissa, I can't thank you, Jeremy, and your team enough for the amazing content that you're putting together and empowering our students to make more informed decisions with, with content they actually want to consume, right? So guys, thank you for making time for, for this webinar. It doesn't look like we have any more questions. We wanted to keep this short, sweet, and brief so you could take it all in and make some decisions. Keep an eye out for uh, the recap email. It's going to have all those links if you didn't grab them and have a fantastic rest of your week.